Hi, I'm Chris Johnston. I'm with Sierra Olympic Technologies. I'm going to describe for you guys the new Tenem camera from DRS. Sierra Olympic Technologies is the North American distributor for this new technology. We've been partnered with DRS for close to a decade now on these efforts, and we're pleased to introduce this new infrared camera core. So you can see the three models that we're starting out with here. The Tenum is a small, compact infrared core. It's based upon an uncooled microbolometer. The format of the microbolometer is 640 by 512, and the pixel pitch is 10 microns. That's differentiated from other pixel pitches, small pixel pitches and long wave cameras nowadays. The uniqueness of this technology is that DRS has mastered wafer level packaging. What that does is it gets away from a manual step in focal plane processing and allows for a more automated, higher throughput focal plane processing capabilities. And so we're introducing this new higher resolution technology at lower pricing and higher performance. And um, we will go through step by step some of the features of this technology. So Tenum is offered initially with three optical options. The 7.7 .7 millimeter has a 49 degree horizontal field of view. The 15 millimeter has a 25 degree horizontal field of view. And the 20 millimeter has an 18 degree horizontal field of view. Tenum is proving to be a highly sensitive microbolometer. The published spec by DRS is 50 millikelvin. We've received a few dozen of these cameras and we've done extensive measurements on uh, these cameras and it's proving to be much better than 50 millikelvin. I'll say uh, the supplier DRS is a, is, a, is a highly reputable company and they're very attentive to their specs and we certainly can meet in every case the 50 millikelvin uh, NETD with the standard temporal noise filters that are applied across the industry. All, all microbolometer vendors have some kind of temporal noise filter. And uh, we've certainly validated that it's well below the 50 millikelvin spec published by DRS, and in most cases, below 40 millikelvin as well. There's an additional filter, a spatial noise filter, that can be applied to these cameras and we're getting an amazing normalized NETD below even 20 millikelvin with um, all the filters applied. So the bottom line is that despite the fact that it's a 10 micron pixel, the Tenum is proving to be an industry leading sensor in terms of the benchmark of NETD. Tenum is primarily an OEM product. It's designed to be uh, integrated into customers' uh, higher level systems. The most basic uh, OEM interface is shown here on this 60 pin board to board connector right here. On this 60 pin connector, you have low voltage CMOS, you have LVDS, those are both digital video options for output, both offered simultaneously. There's a UART for serial communications, and the voltage input is anywhere between 3 and 5.5 volts on this connector. An example of a board that goes on, on, on that 60-pin uh, is the optional feature board. So this is the feature board, and you can see the 60 pin right underneath there. And on this feature board, there's analog video circuitry, so you can get NTSC and PAL analog video, as well as LVDS digital video out. 
It's a more convenient RS-232 serial communication. And the input voltage range is increased from uh, uh, 4 to 18 volts in this case. An example of a, uh, what the 30 pin gives you, you can see what we've done with our connector kit here. Obviously, can't connect reasonable cables to this connector, so you can see what we've done. We've made a harness and developed a board that renders all these signals in, a, in the familiar connectors. Uh, BNC for the analog video, you can see the camera link connector there, a power connector, and the USB connector. Let's talk about other features with the Tenum. Tenum is a 60 hertz frame rate that's uh, twice as fast as the previous microbolometer, the, the Tamarisk that we offered from DRS. The Tenum features the same uh, ICE image uh, contrast enhancement modes that is a combination of local area processing and sharpening. Um, Tenum has uh, color lookup tables for its video output. The mechanical packaging offers IP67 sealing from the front, meaning that the lenses screw into the housing and are sealed and then you can see there's this lock ring and a bulkhead mount so that if you are mounting this into a bulkhead with a designated O-ring as specified in the interface control document and then this lock ring comes down on the O-ring then everything behind the bulkhead will be sealed to IP67. The Tenum offers almost identical compatibility with the Tamarisk. Uh, the same processor base is used with the Tenum as in the Tamarisk, so that for those customers that have integrated Tamarisk, the amount of re-engineering is absolutely minimal. And so we're excited about helping Tamarisk customers realize the benefit of the 10 micron pixel versus the 17 micron pixel of the Tamarisk. Tamarisk is still available. Tamarisk is a very robust and proven technology. But Tenum offers some advantages in that it has industry leading proven sensitivity as well as the smaller pixel pitch that will allow customers to uh, achieve the optical benefits that the smaller pixel pitch offers. Sierra Olympic has been in business for 25 years. We've had a relationship with DRS for 18 of those 25 years. We're the exclusive distributor for their uncooled microbolometers for commercial applications in North America. And we stock volumes of both Tamarisk and Tenorum cameras. We maintain a staff of engineers that pay attention to all the technical details and dedicated support staff to help customers with all the necessary functions to operate and integrate Tenum and Tamarisk into their systems. Thank you very much for watching. Check us out at sierralympic.com or go to the website and find our phone number and call us directly. We're happy to help. Thanks.